What is up there, YouTubes? It's Mr. Sergeant Cottonell here, playing some good old Team Fortress 2 here today on Viaduct, playing as the sniper with the Hitman's Heatmaker. I'm totally gonna be racking up them headshots because basically what happened is, long story short, the, the, that started this gameplay is that uh, essentially in the within the first, I think, little bit of the round here, um, I was trying to soldier and damn snipers kept picking me off. So I just said, you know what? You can't beat them. Join them. So I decided, yeah, I'm going to pull out the old Hitman's heat maker. I'm going to do a little a little counter sniping here. And uh, I guess it worked. It paid off because I uh, end up just going in a bit of a headshot craze. And not only counter sniping them, but taking out some other players as well. And like, look at this guy. Comes out of the teleporter. Pow! Dead. Couldn't even, couldn't even fire around at my teammates. Because, and that's always good, you know. Because as long as you can keep the enemy down and keep them off the point, that's pretty much how you win. Or if you can even get, push them back. Like, I know we've got crazy engineers, um, as you can see here. And look at this. Look at this spy. This obvious slow-moving scout. I have no idea what he's thinking. And yeesh. Ah, God. Sorry about that. I, I, keep, I forgot that that happened. But I guess that actually is um, inside the game where that audio spike happened. And I'm going to try and... Nope, I missed. I missed. I'm not going to hit every shot. I'm still not 100% good with the sniper, in my opinion. Like, I'm still pretty sloppy when it comes to some shots um like yeah it's just i don't know and i don't know how i didn't kill that guy i guess he was overhealed because i totally it said crit shot um on his head so i guess i must have just missed him or something anyway so i'm gonna switch to the i get killed by that spy and i always get annoyed when i get backstabbed as a spy via by a, if i'm a sniper so i always switch if it happens if i find there's a lot of spies i'll just switch over to the razorback like i did there because, yeah, it just gives you at least that one chance to not get backstabbed. Yeah, I know most spies that are pretty decent um, will just switch out, you know, like a revolver or something, gun you, or if it, like an ambassador shot, and then followed up by a body shot even, or two headshots, and you're dead. But, mm, that is okay. And I don't know what that pyro was thinking. He was, like, just sitting white out in the, right out in the open there. Um... And yeah, see, I'm just, I don't know, this is where I just like start, like, I'm just like, I want that, I want that booty, I want that booty, get off my point. And I managed to take out like their heavy, that pyro goes around, takes out him, I'm going to take out the soldier, and we just cap for the victory here. Um, I think I'm pretty sure, yeah, I missed that shot on that pyro. But anyway, not to spoil too much, but yeah, we do win, as you can see there. So anyway, guys, I hope you uh, enjoyed the video. I know it's winding down to a close here. It's kind of the sad part about King of the Hill game types. Sometimes I get, like, you know, a decent time to talk. Sometimes I get only a little bit. But anyway, happy revenge of the or return of the six, and I will see you guys at the next video. Later, guys.